So, America's top diplomat Mike Pompeo has briefed South Korean President Moon Jae-in following his meeting with North Korean leader Kim Jong-un on Sunday. The exact details of what was discussed has not been disclosed, but it appears Kim and President Trump will be meeting for a second time before too long. Our Blue House correspondent Shin Se-min with the details. Another step forward. That's how U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo described his one-day stay in Pyongyang to President Moon Jae-in. Welcoming Pompeo to Seoul on Sunday, President Moon said it was an important moment for the three relevant parties, the two Koreas and the U.S. Pompeo, Pompeo said it was extremely important he hold talks with the leaders of the Koreas in a row, as Seoul plays a leading role in the region's denuclearization. Uh, but we had a good, productive conversation. As President Trump has said, there are many steps along the way, uh, and we took one of them today. It was another step forward, and so uh, this is, I think, a good outcome for all of us. South Korea's presidential office said Pompeo agreed with the North to hold a second summit as early as possible and that working level talks on shaping the summit are expected soon. It also said Pompeo discussed further steps of the regime's denuclearization as well as the issue of the U.S. government being present throughout those steps. Though the main aspects of the meeting between Kim Jong-un and Pompeo, like the shape and form of the next summit, or the corresponding measures from Washington, have not yet been disclosed, Pompeo's visit to Pyongyang was reportedly better than the last. Citing a U.S. official who had accompanied Pompeo to Pyongyang, Reuters reports progress was made, but added it's going to be a long haul. Speculation now lingers on when the next Kim Trump summit will happen, with most watchers expecting it to take place before the U.S. midterm elections on November 6th. Shin Zemin, Arirang News.